can get some relief from the heat here in Omaha as a cold front passes through. Still have a few scattered showers throughout here on live Super Doppler 7. A little bit more activity down to the southwest of Lincoln. So cold front moving through Omaha will be pushing to the south and east. So still a slight chance we could see a few scattered showers and possibly a rumble of thunder, but better chances will be farther to the south as that front progresses that way. Lots of activity just south of the Nebraska-Kansas border, but again, all this pushing more to the southeast with the front that has pushed through today, brought severe weather down to our south in Kansas and up to the north through portions of Minnesota and now into Wisconsin. So our chances to see any of that severe weather pretty much gone here in Omaha. Storm Prediction Center downgraded the severe risk to marginal, but I think most of this will stay south of the metro as we go through the next couple of hours. Then as we go into Sunday morning, I think we're all in the clear. So we'll see a few scattered showers possible in the next couple of hours, then gradually seeing those clouds move out by tomorrow morning. Starting off with the partly cloudy sky, more sunshine by the afternoon. Temperatures back around 90, but less humid. An amazing sunset tonight. You can see the red sky along with the front now pushing through Omaha. Temperatures have been in the mid to upper 80s, still 87 currently in Omaha. Dew points at 70, but I expect these to drop as we go through the next half hour with that front pushing through. Winds now shifting to the west southwest. Light now at three miles per hour. We did heat up today up to 94 after starting off at 78 degrees. So you can see the cooler air back to the west. Temperatures in the 70s from Norfolk back to York to Kama. Denison at 84, Harlan at 81. But you can see most of those low to mid 80s down to the south where the front has yet to move through. But Storm Predictor keeping most of the activity down to our south through the rest of the evening. A few spotty showers still possible before midnight, I think. But then after that, we'll see the clouds start to thin on out. Partly cloudy through the morning, more sunshine through the afternoon with a nice light north breeze, but it will be less humid. So tonight we will cool down back to the upper 60s, 20% chance of that thunder shower mainly south of the metro. Starting off your Sunday, calm, light northwest wind, 73, partly sunny. Less humid in the afternoon, but still temperatures climbing up near 90 degrees. But we will start to cool down gradually on Monday. Still in the upper 80s, but 81 by Tuesday. Lows in the 60s. Best chance for shower and thunderstorm activity looks to be on Wednesday. But look at that high, 78 degrees. And then as we head toward the 4th of July weekend, temperatures more seasonable with those highs only reaching the low to mid 80s.